you know, having graduated after four years of studying performing arts, coming here, I can actually feel that that bridge, you know, is, is being closed by me being here. And now I'm really going out there to go uh, do the most in the industry. So I really do appreciate this experience. If I advised you to charge the most, you'd be asking me why now? What's changed? If I advised you against charging it, that would only reinforce the fact that the party means more to me than you. Either way, I'd be damned. Oh, I can read too, you know. But you don't have to see the notebook. Marawa, Sergeant. It is too detailed for your feeble mind. Much better for you to act in blinkers. Only if your lips were working as hard as your tongue. Well, a long time, a long time ago, a long time ago. <laughs> but you didn't even know where we were going. I can see layers and layers of thick hey. stuff all over your face. Layers and layers of thick all over your face. <laughs> it's it's thick. It makes you look like a hawk. I am a hawk. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I don't think I realized the need for a bridging course between like the, like the institution, university and the real world. It's been so amazing. I came here knowing nothing about acting. I never thought I'd find myself here. It's been absolutely amazing. I've met the right people at the right time, learned so much. Basically, it also helped me to grow as an artist. The biggest challenge was overcoming the fear of that I can't do it because that is a fear that every single artist has and it's one thing that you need. You need to push yourself and push yourself in order to reach a certain character and to open up because so many times we decide to close in and as an artist you need to open up to every single feeling that you have. Um, it provides an intimate space. Um, it provides a place where you are able to talk about everything that an artist goes through, first of all, financially, emotionally, and those are the things that you need to be um, well equipped with so that when you get into the industry, you know very well how to deal with such issues. Seeing other thespians grow, so you just like, you look at yourself and you're like, wow, I just have to grow, I have to grow. Uh, a lot of lessons about life, not uh, about acting itself, but also about life because we were taught how to live, how to behave ourselves as artists and how to be prepared for the industry. A dance out of time, a dance with no music. See, I would linger in non-English speaking arms, so there was no possibility of understanding. You have to do that now. Can't it wait? No. Please. Miss Helen, I'm sorry. But we only have tonight. There, right across the street, she sees this boy. She sees this boy speak and knife into his father. How can she be really sure if you can speak anywhere in my you want to challenge me to be honest with you, Isabel. I'm doing the same. Say it! Were you there when it happened? When he never had a job in his whole life. Supporting the student school boycotts when he did not have a child at school. <laughs> Calling for consumer stairways when he knew who bought the food he ate. So now we're proud to go out there and go look for jobs and say, no, I'm coming from the Dumagan Dumbo Academy. Show us what you have and then you're able to show the people what you're made of. It has changed my life, honestly. It has, you know, boosted my resume. I didn't do anything, but now I'm somebody because of DNA. Where was we at when you was down there rolling around with some god second woman? We should have come to an understanding before you went and made a damn fool of yourself. You're day late, you're done show when it comes to an understanding with me. It's just... She gives me a different idea, a different understanding about myself. I, I can step out of this house and be a different man. And not have to wonder about how I'm going to pay the bills or get the roof fixed. I can be a part of myself that I've never been before. It's been a privilege, it's been an honor, and we've run with it. So if you've come here and you take yourself seriously, you're doing good. <laughs>